right, what's up, guys? We're back with another one here. Yes, more, more Grand Blue. I'm determined to destroy the YouTube channel. But hey, man, this is the game I'm playing now. It's one I'm having fun with. This is what I'm going to talk about. But uh, today, I just want to tell you I am insanely carried. I cannot think of the last time I've been this carried. Maybe with, like, Vanilla Ram in Strive. But I've been playing Catalina. I brought up to Master in, like, a week or two weeks. This character is cracked right now. So I want to just give you a real, real quick summary show you why she's so broken and play a couple games and i think if you are having character crisis right now this is this is the number one recommendation this is catalina's patch right now unless you play belio that's a different story anyway if you like this stuff hit that sub button if you don't come on man how hard i gotta show for grand blue give it give it a shot it's got a free-to-play version but anyway let's go all right so here we go so catalina now she hasn't changed that much right it's like what button is good all of them, right? That's her core design is like, she's supposed to be like a defensive, not really that good, not too high damage, like not really scary, but she's got good poke. So any button you press is really good. But what makes her so scary? Why am I carried? Is this. Let me just show you. This is her new combo. Ready? So like, I'm, my back is to the wall. My back's to the wall. You see that? Basically, any hit you get with her now, anywhere on the screen of any poke, any starter, you will go corner to corner, full B and B in the Oki right now. So it's it's insane. So basically, her her godlike pokes, her godlike whiff punishes now. Before you wouldn't get a lot, right? It's like, okay, look at that. I whiff punish you. Look at that damage right now. But now, any hit, any stray hit, any punish, any anything, you're like 40%, 50% cornered knockdown. So what changed? Why can she do this now? It's actually, this is the other crazy buff. Her shield got buffed. So the speed on it, the follow-up, if you're going to play her, just shield. Just use it a lot. So you can cancel. You can let it rip. Even after the hit or block, you can still dash back. You can still dash forward. Very, very tricky character. And if you do absorb an attack, if you do get that hit, there's like no scaling, massive starter. I don't know why a a neutral base character, they just, they just turn into like a crazy gorilla right now. Something else I want to point out too with this shield. I'm sure if you played this game, even if you haven't, you might know how powerful guard cancels are. The BC, the guard cancel is super broken. A lot of times it's it's basically unavoidable, right? You know your opponent's gonna do it, you just kinda have to deal with it. Well here, this is what Cat can do. So I'm gonna guard cancel. This is a safe jump, guard cancel. So she can shield, punish the guard cancel, and that will do that will do like 60%. That will be the round. So godlike neutral, right? Godlike neutral pokes, godlike damage into the corner, and then shield. Basically, the way I play, play normal. I lose whatever happens. It takes one hit to the corner, one guess. It's a it's a two hit character for some reason. Don't ask me why. I'm not complaining. I'm just being carried right now. But yeah, that's, that's about it. We'll play some games. You'll see. I'm enjoying it while it lasts. There's no way she's gonna stay like this forever. But for the time being, let's play some neutral. So this is actually all right. Hold on, hold on. Now, as much as I hyped up Catalina earlier, she does have a bad matchup. It's this guy right here. Let's see what we can do though. The reason why it's a bad matchup is because, like I said, she's a she's a quote unquote defensive character, but against Lucilius, he's a better defensive character. So you have to go in when you fight this character. You have to approach. Neutral. Let's go to the corner. Let's take his shield if we can, ready? Every time, right? I always tell you what I'm gonna do. And then we play a match and I do it and it works. People, I don't I don't lie to you. Oh, I tried to anti-air but too late. I don't wanna talk too much about Lucilius right now. Another video. But he, he's probably problem character number one right now. He's probably problem character number one. That's another video. We want to get too hard. All right. See if we can take his guard cancel again. Let's see. Ah, uh, he DP'd instead. It's okay. Get out of here. Wee. No risk shield. Wee, wee, wee. Why can I do that? 
Wee. Oh, wait. I forgot he's level 5. Hold on. Wait a second. I forgot. I'm screwing around. I'm dead on the next hit. It's okay. Okay, okay. <laughs> we almost had a good demonstration real quick of, like, why he's problem character number one. I was dead. I'm not joking. Anywhere on screen, if I got touched, I died. Uh-oh. And again, here we go. Safe jump. Topasuru. As you see, right? Just touched anywhere on the screen. Full corner carry and damage. It's okay. It's okay. We got 50 meter. You know what that means. Hey, hey, hey. Uh-oh. Oh, it pushed me away. It's okay. Easy work. So, see, once you're at the corner like that, you don't want to go too ham. You saw I get him in the corner. I kind of back off. You're jailed. Her buttons are so good. If you just kind of stand here and just press buttons, if they, like, move, they jump, they try and do something, they get blown up, and then you just kind of close out the round. But yes, that's that's the power of cat. Let's do it again. Oh, so here we go, Jita. Someone was saying that like Cat was like Jita in the last patch. I kind of see it. Just like God neutral, and then for some reason also God combos, corner carry, and everything. I got 50 meter or 100 meter. Let's go. It's okay. Hey. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, my bad. What an air grab. It was amazing. Should I do? Jump. I got greedy. I got greedy. I got greedy. I died with three guard points. Whenever, whenever you die with three guard points, that's your fault. Before you take a risky option, like I tried to jump there... Before taking a risky option, just guard cancel out. Use your safe option first, and then see what happens. God, that's cheap. Man, you see that? That was off that just random shield. Oh, my God. Are you dead? You are. There's combo. Look at that. <laughs> that was one random shield and then one random hit in the cat combo. I'm Cat Reed with a capital C. Capital K for Cat, I guess. Oh, no. Set up. Can we take a guard cancel here? Yes, sir. She's so cheap, dude. She's so cheap. And I was playing Uno before this. So I went from Cat to Uno. And I felt just like an insane drop in my power level. Like my character's power level. Now I'm back on Cat. Oh, it's good, baby. Ooh. That was styling on me, huh? Is that plus? I don't know. The hell? Ant anti or ultimate? Oh, this shit's sick. Hold on. Look at him styling on me. That was that was god. Like ultimate DP anti air pickup into another ultimate combo and then still lose to cat. Let's go. The classic. That's exactly what happened last time. <laughs> Let's go. Safe jump. Nice jump. I'm alright. Super just for BP. I got one guard cancel, 100 meter. Let's see. Let's uh press button. Brilliant, brilliant. Now I messed up too. So I, it worked out at the end, but I wanted to do button into the ultimate fireball I've been doing all day. Brilliant. 
Brilliant. I take a vein. This is like same thing with Lucifer. It's like this is where Cat struggles at, at high level is the defensive characters where she has to go in. But that by no means means like, oh, this is uh helpless. It's just like uh, she has to play a different game plan, a more aggressive one. Whoa, whoa, chill, bro. What the hell? Uh-oh. There's no way. There's no way, right? There's no way, right? Oh, insane throw. Insane throw. Insane throw, actually. Insane. I should have killed him after the first guard, whatever, but... I may or may not have been drinking some strong zero, but we close it out anyway. The combo. All right, let's see. Can we steal it? Nice. Ooh. <laughs> that was really good. So he he because I hit him earlier, he knew to bait out my my shield, and then he baited out my BC. He's like four steps ahead of me right now. Damn it. God damn. Oh, he got me. He got me. He got me. GG's, GG's. Something I'm happy to see too is that so Vayne got buffed in the last patch. He is, uh, I don't want to say he's like, he's good, but he's definitely not. There was a time where they were like, Vayne's bottom one, bottom three. He's definitely a solid like mid mid tier character now. Good stuff. Good stuff. You'd love to see it. All right. Anyway. Yeah. There you go. Like, like <laughs> not really much to talk about. I showed you everything, right? I also want to, I also want to say this is uh after I haven't played cat in about a month. It's been about a month, I guess, since last time I touched this character, I just kind of booted up. We started this video. So I'm playing super rusty right now. I'm only doing poke in the ultimate fireball and then just shielding it's so basic but so effective right now on top of that when you play her like extra proper with like optimization and then you if you do you know i joked about playing like footsies if you actually do play footsies if you actually do play her patient which is how you're supposed to play pick your spots here with punish and everything little shades gamera she's terrifying but yeah give her a try she's easy that one combo i showed you is very long so it might be intimidating you're like oh that's a long ass combo but it works off any starter. It's very, very easy once you get it down. It doesn't take a lot of thought, so you can do it. Don't be intimidated. Anyway, there you go. So yes, I am I'm super carried right now. I'm kind of tight. I'm kind of tight. I could have beat that Vayne player. I could I, I, I definitely could have closed it out, but that's for another day. But like I said at the start of the video, if you're having a character crisis right now, even if you're not, if you just want to like try something new, then give Cat a shot. It's very fun. It's very fun and it's very... I think it's a good a good uh, learning experience. I think the first time you play a character that is so obviously strong, it's like an eye-opening experience. Earlier, when I went from Vayne to Siegfried, I was like, what the? What is this? Like, why are these characters in the same game, right? Just like the power level was so different. It, it just kind of like realize what other people are playing with. You're like, why not me? Why can't I do that too? So give her a shot. There you go. Anyway, so watch and thank you. This game's fun. I don't know how much I don't know how many more Grand Movement is gonna make though. I think it might be time to join the big leagues. Head on back over to Street Fighter 6. I don't know. If you wanna see more Grand Blue stuff, leave a comment. Let me know. If this video can hit, I don't know, what's a what's a good number? Eight thousand. Eight thousand views will make another one. That's my my promise to you. But anyway, uh thanks for watching. I'll see you next one. Peace.